Hello and Merry Christmas. Scoops Mental Baganda here on YouTube presenting you with last minute Christmas ideas since this is like the big last shop weekend coming up. And I'd like to present to you a couple ideas I have. This is starting off with is for the younger set. These are the little kids. You might like La Popo's Lost Sock. I hope I said the name right. It's by Alexander Sarah, Canadian. He's from Ottawa area and he did this great story here about Popo's Lost Sock. Really funny, really entertaining. Also, from Alex Sarah and Jack Briglio, another Canadian. Canadian! We have Grow Up Enchanted Volume 1 and Grow Up Enchanted Volume 2. Both great stories about a little girl who has magical powers. And I picked up the wrong order. Has little magical powers, and she's not only uses her magic, but she tries her best to use her magic to help people out, but not supposed to. It's really interesting storylines here. Fun for kids. And last one I suggested for little kids is I won this on Twitter. Really cool. Barack Obama of The I Sing, a book he wrote for his kids this last year, in which he tells them about different historical figures he likes a lot and why he thinks they're really cool people. And it's a really interesting book, actually. I haven't read his other books yet, but it's interesting. So, of the icing. And also, another one I'd like to mention, which I don't have copies here of, is anything by William Joycey, who had the guy behind the recent Rise of the Sandman movies, uh, the flying books, fantastic flying books of William Lesmore. My copies are unfortunately being been loaned to Rebecca95 on Twitter. So, get those. William Joycey. Now, for the slightly older child, you might like one of my favorites, Gordon Corman, Canadian. And he wrote this is his first book he wrote when he was 14 years old. It was really fun comedy about Bruno and Boots, or is it Bruno and Boots? I forget which one's which. And their private school lives. Very interesting, funny stories here. A whole series of them. Another one he wrote is. A sequel to Bugs Potter, which is Bugs Potter Live in Nick and Ninny. A very funny story about a guy who hates camping, getting stuck at a camp ground, and creating a rock show. And years later, when he's tried venturing into more mature territory, he wrote Losing Joe's Place, about a younger brother and his friends staying at his older brother's place in the city, and, well, the tales told in flashbacks, chaos ensues. And two ones that really interest me a lot is Real Steel came out about a year or so ago by Hugh Jackman uh, based on a short story by Richard Mathis in a Twilight Zone episode uh, this is fantastic great fun movie about robots boxing each other great fun great story love it a lot and one that makes me just every day all the time Fly Away Home based on a true story by Canadian William Leshman Leshman I forget his names uh, about a little girl who helps these geese learn how to fly to Florida. Love, love this thing, and the ending song just chokes you up right here. So that's my gift ideas for kids, and next I'll have one for teens and adults. Thank you very much, and check you later. And check me out on Twitter at Scoop Riches. And check out my blog, Scoops Mental Propaganda. And hit like to my Facebook page. Thank you very much.